It's a pity the one person who would have enjoyed this the most can't be here. Except, of course, she is. I can see her now. Deep in my heart, so deep in my heart, that You should be doing this. Why did you not see the truck? They're huge. You can't miss them. I didn't. That's in poor taste. You always wear a crap driver. That's how we met. without looking. Yeah, at about five miles an hour. You didn't have to ram me. Excuse me, but whose car is touching whose? Oh, terrific. A woman driver with a woman's logic. And a man with shit for brains. Tell me, were you starved with oxygen at birth? And who was your driving instructor, Stevie Wonder? At least I had one. Oh, how that man must have suffered. It was a woman, actually. Sorry. I know. It's been a long day. I'm going to bed. You keep an eye on him. You need to make up a bottle for his night feed. What would I do without you? You do pretty well. a week, but I don't know anyone else who eats them. Oh, well, someone must. Yeah, one fat sod, that's for sure. <laughs> Bugger it, eh? What do you want to do for lunch? Shh. Pub? Adam, I think it's time we had a little talk. Is this about Betchcombe? Because I admit I haven't finished the report. Or started it. Well, I've had a lot on, not least the system audit. You've done the system audit? It's about this. Your write-up of the Scanbra P20. Oh, yes, right, that's what I've been doing. Yeah, well, yeah. Is there a problem with it? As well as a touchpad, the P20 has a port for an external mouse. Rachel hated mice. Dirty little creatures. Go home, Adam. 
That's an order. I mean, what am I supposed to do? Well, they say don't come in until you're over it, but I am over it. How do I convince them? Well, it might help if you could give it a name. Your death. Just because I don't burst into tears at the mention of you. No, you just mentioned me in memos. Yeah, <laughs> that was a bit unfortunate. But you always did hate mice. Oh, I still do. Oh, no, I don't want company. Who is it? I don't know. You ought to go down. I don't want to. It's antisocial. I didn't invite them. Adam. <laughs> OK. Shouldn't I be? No. Is that why you're all here, then? It wasn't just a coincidence you passing David showing off his new girlfriend? No, Adam, we're here because we're concerned about you. Just us. Me too. Matthew, would you leave your mother alone? Oh, come here. Look at the mess. Look at you. Oh, she's all over you. Dear, dear God, come here. Well, sit down there. Behave yourself. Honestly. Hi. <coughs> Very good. Did you roll all the way over here? I'm going to have to keep an eye on you, boy. <laughs> Rachel. Rachel! Look. A minute ago. <laughs> oh, I would have loved to have seen that. Hello. I can't believe she's gone. I really can't believe it. At home, I keep thinking I hear her, but it's just the house shifting. Maybe I can't believe she's gone either. I thought it would be easier if I went back to work. I wouldn't think about her as much. I spent most of the day falling home. Just to hear her voice. Hello, there's nobody in to take your call at the moment, so if you'd like to leave a message after the beep, we shall call you back. Bye. I miss her so much. I know. I talk to her, you know, all the time. Yeah, me too. Really? Mm. 
Especially when I'm shopping. She was good at shopping. <laughs> if I'm in two minds about something, she makes me buy it. I had a row with her the other day. How weird is that? Thanks for bringing me back here. It seemed the obvious place. I'm impressed you remembered. Some things you never forget. I don't want to say goodbye to her. But I have to. Because she's gone. I love you, Rich. More than you'll ever know. Rest easy, my darling. That's the last hour, I think. Okay. I'll just be a minute. <laughs> you know what I'm looking forward to most? What? Not having to be apart again.